I'm Josh Williams here with Mike Flaherty. We're at Flaherty's in Honeyoy Falls, and uh, we're going to do a little live, a little cooking show here. Uh, tell me what we got cooking. No pun intended. <laughs> Today I'm making a lobster Del Mar. It's one of our featured dishes here at Flaherty's. We've been running it for years. People seem to love it. Now Del Mar means the sea yeah. in Spanish, right? Yeah. So it's, it's actually lobster, shrimp, and scallops. Uh, Parmesan herb sauce over linguine with mushrooms, artichoke hearts, sun-dried tomatoes, and basil. Excellent. Now I see we have some really nice fresh, uh, everything here is fresh, artichokes, yep. mushrooms, everything. So let's get to cooking. I love all of these things here, so I'm all excited right. about watching this process. All right, first thing is get a little butter in the pan. You can never go wrong with butter. Yeah. Let that heat up. You want to flour your lobster tail so it doesn't stick to your pan. And also flour my scallops. Now what's the key? Scallops, everybody talks about cooking scallops. What's the key to cooking a good scallop? Uh, you just want to cook it just so they're just done. You just want to overcook done. them, yep. Alright. Lay these in the pan first and let those start cooking. Now, is there anything in that flour? Is it just regular flour? Any type um, of flour? Yeah, I always season it with salt and pepper. It just adds flavor to all your dishes. So you should always season your flour. Okay. And about how long should you keep this? How long are you going to... Uh, I usually let this sear on one side for about a minute and a half or so, a minute. Now, how long have you been cooking? I've been cooking about 16, 17 years, probably. Not your first time you've cooked this dish, then? No, we run this often. So. Uh, is this one of the favorites here? Yeah, yeah. We try and run at least once or twice a month. So. Now, uh, usually Fridays they do the fish fry. This is like a luxurious, this makes, this loads the fish fry. Yeah, the fish water. fry is always a hit. But, you know, if you want to go for something a little nicer, you come in for this. Now, tell me a little bit about this restaurant here. How long has it been, uh, how long have you been here? This one is going on our third year. So, years. Yeah, our other one is, I think, 30 years. And uh, Maston and the original and Webster you now opened in 1970. So. Now, yeah. one of the things here is it's a, it, this is a big place. You have a giant parking lot. There's plenty of parking. Yeah. Um, I've been here for a couple of March Madness events. You oh, really yeah. do fill up the place. You do a great job uh, as far as always filling up the place. you got a lot of bar, a lot of beer on tap. As well, yep. not that I ever have a beer. <laughs> right. Yeah, tons of local micro brews. All right. Are you putting the mushrooms in? What yep. kind of mushrooms are those? Just regular cotton mushrooms. Okay. And but that is really good and brown as well. Yep. Want to sear that a little on the other side? Now, uh, any other, do you have live music occasionally here? Uh, yeah. I saw a nice patio there. Saturday nights we have a live band. Uh, we don't do it in the summer just because summer Saturdays are a little slower. So, but every other time of the year, it's always a live band on Saturday nights. Draining that wonderful butter. Yes, you want to drain your butter. And you want to hit it with your fresh garlic. Okay. White wine. And you have yet to figure out a camera that can transmit smell, but that wine smells. And then you drop your shrimp in it, so it won't take very long. So you don't want to do it all together. You don't want to throw no, it all in there. The shrimp go in a little after when you put the wine in. So it'll cook right in the wine. Now are these, uh, what kind of shrimp are these? Just regular? Uh, these are tiger shrimp. Tiger shrimp. 16, 20, so you get 16 to 20 per pound. They're a good sized shrimp. I put a little, uh, some dried herbs, we call it magic. Magic. <laughs> the magic herbs. Yeah. We got sun dried tomatoes going after that. And now we're flying. Now it's yeah. sort of timing, and you, know, you want to make sure everybody. Uh, yeah, hit it with your chicken stock. Okay. <laughs> The uh, sun-dried tomatoes really add a lot of nice color there. Yeah, exactly. And the fresh basil at the end really looks nice in there, too. And you put your little artichoke hearts in, corded artichoke hearts. 
artichokes, the key to any great meal. <laughs> you want to finish it with like two pads of butter. Why the pads of butter? Ah, uh, burnt the sauce together, kind of thickens it up, and gives a little more flavor too. And you sprinkle with the parm cheese. And fresh chopped basil. We've got lobster, shrimp, scallops, yep. sun dried tomatoes, mushrooms, artichokes, lots of butter, some wine. <laughs> what would be a, a good wine to have at part, to pair this with? Uh, I'd say a white wine. Okay. I don't know. Not big on wine. Not guy, big on wine. Or beer. Or beer is always good. Yeah. yeah. Uh, an IPA? IPA, you know, all those. Yeah. And right down the road, there's custom brew factors here. Yep. And then uh, that's about it right there. A little more of this again. And that's our lobster del mar. Lobster del mar. And we put a server over the meat of the sea. So once or twice a month you have this special. What's a good way that people can find out, get a hold of the restaurant, they can find out your specials? Do you have Facebook or website? Uh, we're actually getting on Facebook shortly. We're putting that together. Okay. We have uh, instant contact though, or constant contact. Constant contact. Constant contact. Yep. So you can go on there and check out what we're running and uh, what we got going on, any bands we got. You I can see. always check that out. No Facebook page, that's interesting. Really, he's getting it going right now. He's, uh, in the works. I, I know you have an employee that's very good at using social media. Oh yeah? Yes, yeah. <laughs> Leah Shea does a great job at, at posting stuff at Facebook. So you might have somebody uh, in-house that could yeah. you know, take on that task. Leah can tighten us up with yeah. that. Not that she's not busy or anything. And just plate that over the top like that. That looks amazing. Oh, and I finished a little Asiago cheese. Asiago, never been there. <laughs> right. And you can see the steam coming off of that. A little last year, I'm going to finish it up. And I'm going to walk this around to the camera Okay. Here. We ready to roll here? Yep. All there right. we go. And that's the lobster del mar. Lobster del mar. Not bad. Okay. So uh, what's your phone number here if somebody wants to come in and order this as well as uh, make a reservation? Okay. Anyone know the phone number? No. <laughs> I got it right here. Well, let's get the number here. Yes. Yeah. Okay. No, that's fine. Uh, Look, oh Google God. it. Google it. Flaherty's. Yeah. Google yeah, Flaherty's. Like you never call yourself at work. All right, so here we go. To have the lobster del mar, uh, call, make a reservation here. 585-497-7010. Uh, Flaherty's. Family name. Yep. Family operation. Yep. What do you think? Uh. <laughs> good good cooking show. This is pretty smooth. Yeah. So we're going to do this uh, every now and then. We'll come in here when we have a nice special and okay. they, can, they can check it out. So Perfect. this is GenCSun.com. I'm Josh Williams with Mike Flaherty. Give us a call. Come on okay. down. We're about to eat this. <laughs>